from our government, we will drive out the globalists, we will cast out the communists, Marxists and fascists, we will throw off the sick political class that hates our country, we will rout the fake news media, and we will liberate America from these villains once and for all. Before we go too far, I've got something to tell you. Let us charge together with a shared vision that builds on American greatness. Let's seize this moment and create a country for tomorrow, the future that we deserve. And now, please welcome our next Commander-in-Chief, my husband, President Donald J. Trump. I'm not going to take it anymore. Kamala, you're fired. Get out, get out. You're fired that every time she does an interview, I think Donald Trump picks up about 100,000 votes. Now, the other day, CNN asked if she had made any mistakes as vice president. Now, here's what she actually said, and I am quoting word for word. She said, in my role as vice president, I mean, I've probably worked very hard at making sure that um, I am well-versed on issues, and um, I think that is very important. It <laughs> When did you think you'd be able to get RFK Jr., Tulsi Gabbard, Elon Musk? People from all different walks of life, incredible skill sets, whether it be health, whether it be technology, everything. You have them on one unified ticket. Think about that, compare that to Kamala Harris and Tampon Tim. It ain't the same, folks. Timmy ain't fixing anything, and neither is Kamala. We're gonna get the government off your back and out of your pocketbook. And Amer America's just not, not gonna, just gonna be great. America is gonna reach heights that it has never seen before. The future is gonna be amazing! One question for okay. you, and then I'm getting out of here, because right. this is your stage. But we set up Doge. Yes. How much do we, you think we can rip out of this wasted $6.5 trillion Harris Biden budget? Well, I, I think we can, we can do at least $2 trillion. Yeah! <laughs> yes. hey, Michael, we have great people. We have Baron homies watching. That Baron is watching. He's the king of the internet. He's the king of the internet. Oh. And so, ladies and gentlemen. This is a wonderful, wonderful campaign. I mean, we want to talk about winning 50 states. Do this. Former president has repeatedly praised a period in American history where there was no income tax, meaning the majority of American history, and the country relied on tariffs to fund the government. Here we go. Former President Donald J. Trump has spent much of his uh, presidential campaign brainstorming new and sometimes untested ways to cut taxes. In the election's final stretch, he raised the possibility of doing, go, going even further, eliminating income taxes entirely. This is true. I'm going to cut your taxes. I gave you the biggest tax cut in the history of our country and the biggest regulation cuts in the history. And we're going to cut them further. You voted, but you promise you're going to vote? Everybody promise? Robert, promise, promise, promise. There's a lot of people in here. Good morning, everyone. Wasn't that an amazing rally? I think that was the best rally ever in all of American history. 
oh my gosh, I just loved it. The energy, I mean, everyone is just pumped. We are excited for our future. He's definitely coming back, there's no doubt. Hands down, New York is now red, for sure. <laughs> Especially after all that. There's so many people outside as well as full on the inside, like just gorgeous. Such, such an amazing high frequency rally that was. And Melania was there, just, it was just amazing. So I'm sure you all enjoyed it. If you didn't get a chance to watch it all, you should. There were also quite a few drops and that's what we're gonna pull cards on today. So I wanna pull cards on so now Trump did say Baron is king of the internet, but then he also did say very, and it's very sly, so it's hard to catch it. I'm gonna go back and watch the whole thing and find it to show you. But there is a small part in there when Trump says that Elon Musk and himself have a secret after the election. They have a secret for us, a surprise after the election. So I want to get more details on that. I want to know if I can pick up anything about it and see what we get. Um, but also King of the Internet Baron, of course. <laughs> so cute. I mean, he's up to something too. We know that he's very galactic like his parents. But uh, yeah, there, there's something with that as well. And the little clip that's in this intro video of Donald J. Trump saying Baron is king of the internet was actually 17 seconds. So I just wanna throw that out there as well. Uh, the time that it took him to say that was 17 seconds. So, wow. <laughs> but anyways, let's pull some cards. Let's take a look. So when Trump mentioned that Elon Musk and himself have a secret surprise they're going to release after the election, what is that? What does it, what was he talking about? What is the secret? Here we go. Let's see what we got. All right, so we have the star card. I don't know if you guys could see it, but this is the star card. So Aquarian energy. And if you don't know the astrology right now, we are moving into Aquarius. Pluto is moving into Aquarius November 20th, okay? So this is about, um, you know, technology, which we've got Elon. But so something transformative, it's gonna be transformative for the people. And I feel it is technology. So it's leading me to believe that this is about the internet. So maybe it's free internet, free power, free, free every, the electric, all of that for everyone. So I wonder if that is what this big transformation is with the star card. All right, so very well could be. We have the King of Wands, okay? So it's gonna happen quickly. It's gonna be a massive change that's quickly helping all humanity, okay? So I don't think it's just the United States. I think it's eventually going to help everyone globally, okay? King of Wands. Then we have the Eight of Wands, more fast, fast energy. I hope you guys can see this. So the Eight of Wands, the King of Wands, and the Star card, great transformation. It's gonna happen very quickly. It's gonna impact more lives than just the United States. That's what I'm getting. I do think it has to do with the internet and power, electricity, all of that, I do think is going to be free. I really do. We already saw, um, I believe it was the last video I posted, we did the cards on the free income tax, so no income tax. Okay, freedom from income tax. That is true. And that also was verified once again by Benny Johnson. And that is in my intro into this video. Uh, I put that little clip in there. But yeah, it's, it's real. It's being reported. It's real. It's coming from Trump. So no income tax. And also right here, it appears to be that the big secret for Elon and Trump is about free energy free energy, free internet. So there you go. I love this. This is great. All right, guys. So now we're going to look into Melania's beautiful zebra outfit and how it ties in with the Q post. As you see in the beginning video, the intro video to this, what you're watching right now, it is in the Q post. So zebra, zebra, bring the thunder, kill box, light with Okay, so it's light underscore T, 
1A23-GO5. Okay? GO5, I do believe, is November 5th. I do believe GO5 means the 5th of November. Um, so 1A23-GO5. There's something with that 23. I'm not really sure what that is. But I do believe that it's all positive. I do believe it's positive. The thing that I'm, I'm getting with this, though, is we could encounter an internet shutdown. Okay, so media, internet, power, there could be a shutdown. Will it last very long? I don't think that they're gonna endanger the American people, especially those in hospitals that need the power and electricity. Electricity. I don't think that that's going to be the case. So I don't think it's going to endanger any lives, but I do believe that Bring the Thunder, Killbox, Light, I believe all of that, and also Zebra Zebra, so they're trying to signal you know, her outfit, but also black and white is balance, dark to light as well. Um, so, you know, shutting them down, shutting all their power down and control completely. It's a washout. I mean, they're definitely never, they're never going to have control ever again over the people, especially if you look at astrology, we're moving into Aquarius. So Pluto leaving Capricorn is moving into Aquarius November 20th. Okay. So that's even more proof going forward that we're moving into a whole new world, a whole new generation. Technology is a big part of that. We're going to have a great future, a very exciting future. So think Aquarius. If you don't know much about Aquarius, go research. But Aquarius is about freedom, sovereignty, also technology, out, thinking outside the box. But it's also transformation for our world and what we're doing and how we're how we're making things happen in our lives, our daily lives, as you can see. So Elon Musk playing a big role in the next years to come and all the history, all of the, the future. And I do believe he was a part of history too. He's a time traveler, just like Trump and Baron. Now Baron, king of the internet is also, he is also working on some things too, um, futuristic things as well. So watch out for Baron. I do think king of the internet was also another drop um, about the internet shutdown that is to appear and approach very shortly. I do believe it has something to do with November 1st to the 3rd. I do. Uh, right up, right up against, right before that election date of November 5th. So yes, it's going to be very heavy. It's going to be intense. There's going to be people in conflict, people that aren't so happy about what's going on or what they're hearing and the disclosures that they're seeing. The Twitter files as well, I do believe is coming this either this weekend or shortly after the election. So it's very, very tight what's happening right now. So it's exciting. So hold on to your frequency of high vibrations, just as you saw last night in that beautiful rally, the best rally I've ever seen for sure. But anyways, not only that, but, um, just every industry is going to go through transformation in the future here, forward, go, moving forward. So the food, the pharmaceuticals, internet, all of it. Yeah, all of it. So anyway, let's pull some cards on the Q post that was put out March 3rd, 2018. Zebra, zebra, bring the thunder, kill box, light, underscore T, 1A, 23, dash, go five. Q. Here we go. Here's the Hierophant. So the Hierophant, going back to old values. Also, spiritual. This is a very spiritual card. Bringing back good beliefs, religious beliefs. Letting people be who they are, truly. Authenticity, big time. Okay, so that's the world we're moving into. This Q post has a lot to do with moving into a world of authenticity. Then we have the Ten of Pentacles and Fortune. Then we have the Tower card, demolishing the dark. Bringing the people back to light, sovereignty, independence, freedom. Freedom of speech. Freedom to live their lives and, and enjoy them, not having to be a slave to the system. So that's the tower card. Beautiful. This is good. Then we have the six of cups. Then we also have the moon card. 
and this is a newer card in my deck only no other deck has it um beating against the odds surviving and helping okay so this is symbolizing how they're going to transform and help the people we've seen trump do it no matter how much they knock him down he comes right back up that's exactly the energy of this whole transformation there's a lot more behind the scenes that we don't know that's going on that they're making happen for all of us then that moon card with this beautiful six of cups helping the children saving the children that's all going to come out all of we already know a lot has already come out about the traffic ing but so much more especially leading up to the days of the election you're going to hear a lot more about that and again with that tower demolishing the dark all systems of the dark demolishing them and exposing them that is in the com the very short days here leading up to the election we're eight days away but i'm telling you something having to do with the first through the third to the fourth very heavy very heavy energy around those dates and i don't normally put dates out there but i'm telling you that's what i feel um those days leading up to it very intense is it gonna hurt anyone no i think it's gonna be hard to hear for some but i don't think it's gonna hurt anyone now the vatican i do think the vatican's a part of this as well i think they're gonna get into it on a very deep level and expose a lot of you know, ugh, I feel it's going all the way back, all the way back. I'm talking even like the 40s, the 50s, like really far back we're getting into. And then the financials. And that's why it is being highly encouraged to vote for Trump about income tax too, because we're going to have no income tax. Um, and you guys saw my clip here in the video of Benny Johnson too. He's out there. He's, he's spreading the word too. So spread the word because you guys aren't, none of us are going to have to worry about all that, the tax stuff. Okay. So all of that is coming forward here. So it's looking really good as we lead into election day on November 5th. If you guys haven't voted already, I encourage you guys to, I did on Friday <laughs> and request a bubble ballot. You can they aren't so um friendly when you ask for that <laughs> they kind of try to talk you into the other one but make sure you ask for you don't have to make sure you ask for it but i mean i will i i like the bubble ones better you bubble it in yourself and then you go put it in the box so but anyways guys i hope you enjoyed this and remember to check out my website, arcanashores.net, and I do have a scent coffee sitting right here. Um, so I just want to bring that up too. It's my favorite coffee, and you guys really check it out. If you haven't ever tried it before, check it out. And then pine needle extract, a great detox if you've had the thing in the arm, mandatory thing, or if you know someone who has. This will help you detox it. Um, this is all part of Maha as well. So, yep time to get it before it's going to be gone <laughs> but anyways thank you guys so much and remember my personal readings i do offer on my website arcanashores.net that's all there for you and we still are having our patriot sale until november 5th so i will see you all very soon and you guys take care of yourselves don't forget to leave your comments below if you have any questions for the next show that i do any questions i will pull cards for you and also, don't forget hit to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. But until uh, tomorrow, I'll see you. I'll see you guys. Have a good one. Bye. Voting Donald Trump, baby. Donald Trump, baby. America needs saving. America needs